I just clean my fish's tank. Back. No, it's mine. Anna's fish's tank, and I um, thought I did a pretty good job at it. But um, when I put him back in, he was now we have too much bubbles. fighting to swim around. And now he's just... Yeah. As you can see, he has a lot of fin damage from bacteria. I don't know. I guess I need to do okay, some okay. more research. So this is what's it going on. Is. He's trying to swim. And he um, is going back up. He is just he doesn't have the energy. I don't know what's going it on. It looks like his back is bent. When he's trying to swim. Look like his I can see his mouth. Oh, Bep. He was to... such a beautiful fish when Bep, when we just got Bep and he was swimming around. His fins look so pretty and now look at him. We had Bep for a little see? over a see? year See? See? Look now. like he's been. Yeah. He's really fighting up, guys. I don't know what all of these bubbles are about. I cleaned the tank. I rinsed it thoroughly a few times. Um, what I've always been doing, I don't know. Why is not working? It worked on my fish. Michael said that he had a fish and it was what? Well, it was dying? Yeah. And put the fish in the sun and the fish catch back itself. But, I don't know. Bep's been suffering, you could see, for a while now. So, if this is the Bep's last day, then so be it. We love you, Bep. Hey Jays, it's late on in the day now and I'm heading to the bank. I put on some makeup and I'm a little bit dressed. I ain't going nowhere. I just want to take advantage of Michael taking some pictures of me. Um, he never wants to. What it is with guys never wanted to take pictures, yo? You all have zero patience. Zero. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm going to do that and I think I'm going to meet them by the laundromat, him and the kids. Because uh, they left a while ago too do some laundry so that is what the rest of the day is looking like all right let me see if they're at the laundry mat because you know they don't like to stay still are they in here hello <laughs> so we back i took some pictures in the park so that was good I noticed I took like so many pictures like posing and stuff like that and then I took some pictures just chilling like with no pose just standing there with just my hand on my waist or whatever and those came out better I'm such a basic like so just left work I went to the corner store and I couldn't remember what the heck I went for. If this coronavirus symptoms was forgetfulness, boy, I would have been panicking right now because I stood in there and I looked around. I'm like, what did I need? I guess I'll come back to Melita on. So I'm just going home to relax a little bit and I'll probably cook some pilau and it's just work as usual for me this week. I've been using, let me show you guys, my fault though, but I thought that seen it? I thought that it was because I was mixing this with my Pons Clarent Cream that it was breaking me out, but it seems like it is continuing to break me out. I'm not eating anything that usually breaks me out which is chocolate and nuts i haven't been eating those um i have not been mixing it with the ponds but i really want to use this it's super light it smells good i'm just mad because this is a fresh bottle of this and if this is the reason why i'm breaking out like this it's not good look at my skin Look at my skin. My skin is usually really clear. Not really clear, but you know. The skin. I'm just I'm just not in I'm not in the mood for this. Look at all of that. I don't have time. I don't know. 
but I needed to use moisturizer with SPF, you know. It's a must, especially for everybody. <laughs> so I don't know what's going on. I just need my face to stop doing this. This is unusual. Five different numbers. Number number one. Number two. Someone will be held responsible. Thank you for calling Chipo Air. Eh eh. To make a new flight, hotel, or car. I guess so. <laughs> that I used to do my um, pay loud video years and years ago sue me okay sue me so um, I'm trying a different way to do pay loud other than the traditional Trini way um, I actually cooked my chicken they're almost done they're boneless chicken and I find when I yes, do pay loud with the yes. boneless chicken I overcook the chicken and it becomes rubbery. Go ahead, Anna. It becomes rubbery. So I decided to kind of like halfway cook. I decided to kind of halfway cook the chicken. Well, mostly cook the chicken first. Fry it down and all of that stuff. And now I'm doing the rice. I have my carrots, my peas. I already put my um, coconut milk and all of that stuff. So I will let you guys know how this comes out. When the rice is almost done, I'll put back in the chicken. I might put the carrots in before and I'll Yay! see how this goes. So I forgot to give you guys a Bep update. He is still alive, guys. Yeah. He's still pushing through. He looks horrible, but I am doing my best to keep it together. I will be changing his water 
um tomorrow i change it every other day but i don't know if it's the fact that i moved him into the bedroom i find that his water is getting dirty um like on the top faster um yeah so i don't know if i'm gonna move him back into the living room i moved him because it was always kind of like cold out in the living room but as it's warming up now he might be better being back out in the living room so we shall see so we are out here we meaning out here with analia um got up this morning cut my nap in half in hopes of um, well, we have to get the computer, and here we're all gone. Yep, the computers were all gone. They said 10 to 2, 10 to 2, by 10.52, <coughs> my phone rang. I'm like, okay, they're just updating us about the computer. Yeah, right, they were all gone. Yeah. So I guess Anna has to do all her work on her iPad. iPad. So we out I'm here, I spoke to Anna before we left the house. It's very, very important for her to keep her hands in her and pockets. She did a good job. She didn't touch anything and stuff like that. But like we definitely got to wash up and stuff when we get inside. I'm going to sanitize everything with some wipes when I get in. We ain't playing no games out here. Wipe. All right, guys. Last I told you, the laptops were gone. Anna's teacher, she came in clutch, yo. And then what's more clutch is that my uncle was able to give us a ride so we didn't have to you know walk back out here so that was pretty decent <laughs> so we on and popping yes 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 thanks uncle who's that Caribbean breeze, you know. Beautiful night. Alright, guys, I will end the vlog here. I have a slew of videos coming to you. I hope you all enjoying the content. Be sure to thumbs up the video. Alright, later.